and welcome back to another one of my videos. Today, we are playing a game called Skyblock. If you don't know what Skyblock is, but you have played Minecraft before, you may kind of reference, like reference this, like the square blocky things and all. Um, you may seem that like Minecraft looking. Like, let me get a good block. Uh, let me just place one randomly. Um, yep, there, perfect. It's like square Minecraft object. And I've been playing this game for quite a bit, and I've been wanting to make a video on it. So today's the day I've been making a video on it. So, um, there's like in this game you have to harvest, sell, um, in some Skyblock servers in Minecraft where you can join in multiplayer, those servers have like totems where you can sell stuff, you kind of can. But I'm on PC right now, so let me explain some things. If I click E, it opens up my inventory with all my legendary items. No, they're not really legendary. Um, if I click, once I click E and then I click on my hotbar, it removes that item because when you load in, it just randomizes it, whatever is in your inventory. Because then, it's, uh, there's, there's actually a lot more things than you think that there would be in this game. Let me organize my hotbar. I need that, I need that, and I need that. Okay, so, let me first explain a few things. First, this is my house. I'm still working on it. I haven't worked on it in a while because I've been working on something that's over there. Um, let me show you what's in it. There's a cooking table where you can cook food and I'll explain what food does soon. Um, there's this clay table. I really need to work on some of these. I need some of you. Uh, let's see. I'm going to craft more. <gasps> Ooh, this is where you can craft stuff. How do you craft a glass block, by the way? Uh, let's see. I don't know how to craft a glass block. Huh? We will find out how to craft that soon. Um, this is stone cutter. You can, you can. Uh, let's see what it does. Okay, I go here and I put the coal in, and then it it makes that cool looking noise. And then let's wait for it. Come on, do it, do it, do it. Boom! Stone brick. Easy stone brick, but it's not a lot. There's chest furnaces, sawmills, and yeah. But now you're wondering what these are. These are totems. I need to mine these actually. But there's a few types of totems in this game. And well, they spawn stuff. And if you put them in a conveyor, I'll show you what that does once I actually uh, build the thing. I'll be mining these out later. Um, so I'll show the portal and all later on. But let's get on with my factory. Let me just show you a good look. It's still a work in progress. I'm going to remove these stone, build the walls. But this is it so far, and I'm looking for one worker, just one worker at the factory that I can trust, and well, a thousand dollars every two days, uh, if if you play constantly, kind of. Uh, if I if I see you second day, but you did some work, yeah, you get the two thousand. But let's go on in the factory. Um, I removed most of my things so far, and I'm, I'm gonna upgrade this first level, but. Here are some of my food totems. Um, there's onion totems in this game, and I and stone totems too, and all, and the iron as I showed you at the start. But the onion totems, I'm using it for something special, and the stone totems are in my inventory. Yeah, and the clay totems. So this is like something that it's kind of like. Um, I destroyed this one, but uh, let's see. Let me just show you something. Uh, where is my clay totem? Uh, where is it? Do I seriously? Uh, there it is. Uh, place that. Where's my coal totem? Find. Oh my god, I have 10 of these? What the heck? Why do I have a lot of those? Okay, wait for it. Come on. Do it. Do it yourself. And you can look right here. I'm not holding anything, so I'm not accidentally placing it down. I don't have it in my hot bar. Come on, I know you can do it. Wait. Oh my god, these are the same. Here you go, Oh my god, I'm in. I'm a dum dum. Dum dum. Where is me? Totem. Good. Now this is the right totem. Now let's see where is it. Yep, place down clay. Okay, come on. Coal totem. I know you can do it. Just so you, just so you don't take as long, I'll just place a few dozen of you. This should work now. I hope you can do it, coal totems. I know I'm counting on you. Come on, fill it up. Now you can see it just went in. Now it's about to go. Come on. Okay, 
this this coal totem is evil, so I'll just place it. You get the point. It drops this coal. Oh my god. Oh, never mind. It did it for me. Nice. And now it goes in here. Now it's smelting that, and now if I go here, it's gonna end up as brick. You can do this with iron. There's the brick. And I collect this for my factory's work. And that's where my factory is built of. Built of. I'll actually keep this going for a little bit and let's let's see if this can get to max because it's not that big. I usually do a lot more, but let's see if we can get to max at the end of this episode. Um, I hope I'll remember to check on it. <laughs> so next we're gonna start up with my office where I have a little special office where I observe on the workers and there's a three tier three workbench. But I think I'll explain that on another episode. These are my berry bushes. You can sell some um, crops. Oh my god, I got a seed. Yay, I'm happy. Um, you can harvest these and then sell them where, where that portal is. There's a seller that keeps them, gets them basically. And then this is where I needed my onion totem for. Um, it's a money making farm. I'm still, of course, gonna upgrade this and I'm gonna make the smaller and go make a um, elevated tower out of it. So it's the best and efficient for me. Um, already I get a lot, but I'm not using onions for selling it. I'm using that to eat because when I kill those monsters on the other portal, this is why I need this axe. You, you usually start with a wooden sword. Where is my wooden sword? This is the wooden sword. And then you go to this war axe and then you go to this big boy. Yeah. Um, I'm working on a shop right here. This is going to be called the Foul Flower Shop. But let me show you one more thing before we go into killing monsters and let's see if we get lucky. Um, this is where we do our most of the business. We sell a lot of gears, mostly. Let me find a gear. Um, gears are, are able to make smelters, sawmills, ovens, and uh, one more thing. I just can't remember what that is. Huh? Uh, let's see. Yep, I can't find a gear. Can I really not? Wow, I really can't find a gear. Yeah, I must be blind. You probably, you, you guys are probably shouting at me like, "Oh my God, the gear is somewhere on this!" No, literally, I. Where is the gear? Oh my God, it's right here. I have 49 of these. I sell one for 30 or 60, um, depending if people actually want it. Blue gears I sell for about 100 to 175. Pink gears I sell for about uh, 1,000 to 2,000 per one. Um, but let's stop explaining and let's see how this works. So first, if they're going to drop the item here, like let's pretend this is $10,000 and they're wanting to buy like 10,000 pink gears. Uh, I placed that or they placed that there. I see it. But even though I place that at the same time as them, it takes longer for me. So if they try to scam, I take their item pick up mine and I give them something back but I don't give their item back because they're trying to scam I give something else valuable but not as valuable uh, so then I place the ten thousand dollars in here I hope I placed that right because sometimes it glitches out yep place it right okay let's let me go here where it actually shows shows it and it's coming there you can see the grass block I showed the system system now it goes down now it goes over here and boom uh, boom you can see it now let's get on to the portal where we can start to kill those beasts um there's a new update where they have this new hammer and there's new gilded tools with the war axe of course but i can't get the gilded tools right now because it's kind of a little hard for me i'm gonna have to grind for a few hours that i really don't want to do um I got this in at least an hour or an half an hour, at least. It didn't took too long because I got super lucky. Um, I had keys, do you get that from that totem guy that was on the side of me? Uh, I, not the totem guy, that's wrong to say. Oh, ooh, what, what, what the, am I able to, what, what, what just happened? I'm so confused, but these slimes are evil beasts that are trying to kill us. Holy moly, wait, what? They just froze. Um, okay, strange. Um, you can get these little blue keys. Uh, let me show the red keys. Uh, where is it? 
Where is the red keys? Yeah, this is the slime island key where you buy it from a from the guy for 200 coins. I have 10,000 army. I just had to trick one of my friends playing this that I had none. But then I this is the the key that drops from these guys. I'm gonna see if I can try and get one. Um, I'm not that lucky with this axe. Like, watch me get so many island keys with this axe instead of the better axe. That should be better. And I should be getting them faster, but apparently I don't. Um, the reason I needed the onions is that, uh, oh yeah, here is where, um, you can get the stuff. The reason I need the onions is that they heal me. Yep, see, I already got an island key right there. It's so easy to get with this axe. But watch, I probably won't get this. Imagine I do. Um, so I don't know how, what the exact numbers are for the new, like, axes and all for each number. But you get the point. Let me get these onions, and now let me go to um over here where this portal island is, and to and we are going to be killing these beasts. Now, if you didn't know, these beasts are giving I don't know how to say it. There's like buffalo. I think that's how you say it, kind of. Um, they drop crystals, and um, let me show you one. I think I have one. No, I don't. I forgot. I I crafted this axe, this legendary axe with them, and yeah. So, it, these, this is a weapon, and like the wooden sword and the battle axe, or war axe, they do more damage each time. And this is the best weapon you can possibly get, but, uh, well, this weapon does, I think, the most damage. I don't think it's the fastest, because I've seen, like, some wooden swords are pretty fast. I'm not quite sure about that, but... Yeah, if you see I got this gold ore, that's the new thing in this new update. And you have to try and get them to make some of the new stuff like gilded tools, gilded iron rods, and well, etc. So these beasts are going to try to kill me, but I will kill them. So, um, with this best weapon in the game, it doesn't take as long. With the wooden sword, it takes 40, um, hits. I'm not quite sure about the battle axe, or war axe, I mean. I keep calling it battle axe. Wow. A um, war axe. But, yeah. I'm gonna try to get a crystal out of them, or as much gold as possible. Oh my god, I'm gonna mine, 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 mine. If you didn't know what that was, that was a gold ore. Sadly, I didn't get any, because I didn't mine as much, but they did. So, um... Basically, gold is very important, and there is kind of trading in this game. Trading is where... Oh my god, he went flying! Holy! I barely see those guys when flying. Um, so, well, just kind of trading in this game, and... Oh, sir? Are you Mr. Wizard Guy? Um, you are like Harry Potter, but on a wizard room. Oh my god. Okay, I got another gold ore, but... Oh my god, I need to stop talking right now for a second. Give me this gold, please. Mine. I didn't get any, what? How many am lucky? Never mind, I got one. So, um, the, when I was saying there's trading in this game, it's not really trading, you chat, and then they're gonna give you the item. Now, that shop, I kind of made it kind of scam proof in a way, so people can't scam, and I don't scam them in a way. You could say that. Um, so, that helps. So, oh! Okay. These buffaloes or buff beasts are going crazy. They're like wizards in a broom. They just go flying all of a sudden. You see what I mean? They're like wizards on a broom. They go like flying like boom. Bam. I'm going to kill this beast now. Die. Boom. You're serious. I get iron ore from you? You know what? That is very sad. Let's see if I can kill this beast and get gold. Are you going to be the lucky beast and give me gold? Are you? Are you? Okay, okay. Uh, I'm low. This is a good opportunity to show this. Now, if you look over here in my houses, that's my health bar. If I eat, it goes up. Again, went up. Oh, you're gold. But I tried to not make it go under, um, at least here I tried to heal up at that point. But I think this is going to end off today's episodes, everybody. So, bye!